anaconda. Anybody have any other questions about our snake or anacondas in general so far? Yeah. She's got a slow, and if you watch her jaw, you see how she's moving her jaw one part and then another little bit? That's called locking their jaw. Snakes do that to help move the food into their mouth because they don't have any arms or anything. Now, for those of you that can't see it very well, I'm actually trying to get some video of it here. So hopefully, we'll be able to show that off to everybody. Kim, it's, it's going to get you. If you come back over here and look up here, you might be able to see it a little bit better. Can you see it there? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah? Why doesn't it eat the fish? Why doesn't she eat the fish? Fish are not the favorite food of anacondas. They prefer warm-blooded meals like guinea pigs, mice, rats, stuff like that. And also, she's just lazy. When she gets given food like this all the time, why bother going after a fish? Yeah, she ate it! Yep. Just got a little bit of a leg and tail left to go there. And then down it goes. So those are the two big reasons why she doesn't go after the fish in here. Laziness and it's not her favorite food. Now, you guys, did you just see that? Did you see how she opened her mouth sideways? A snake's bottom jaw is not connected, so they can move it in two different directions at once to help get food into her body. 